friend fit. I hope you watching at home were part of that fitness routine. Here with me in the kitchen this morning is Chef Sally. And she's of course serving us some comfort food. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> All right, this morning we are making potato pancakes, people, with sunny side up eggs. Yes. Yeah. I'm excited about this morning's breakfast because potato pancakes, never had that before. Interesting. It's very nice. <laughs> it is. Let's talk about the ingredients. So, first of all, we have our potatoes yeah. that we've already grated. Irish potatoes. Irish potatoes. Yeah. You can actually use sweet potatoes as well. Yeah. Then we have eggs, flour. Mm -hmm. Then our seasoning, just salt, black pepper, chili flakes, and um, chili pepper and Cameroon pepper. Okay. Then we're going to add in some onions and sausages. Okay. So I see what you did with the sausages there, just in case you're wondering what kind of yeah. sausages are those. <laughs> she actually grated them. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a normal sausage mm. that have been grated. So I'll just get some onions as well mm, and just fuse that in. Yeah. Oh, that's gonna add a lot of flavor. Yeah, exactly. To the potatoes. So you just grate a bit in there. Okay. And then you have to, the next thing we have to do is get out the liquid. So we're going to transfer this into a cheesecloth. Okay. You can use a normal a kitchen cheese. cloth. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can use a normal kitchen napkin okay. if you don't have this. Can you great can the potatoes be smaller than this? Yeah, they can. You can use any um, like of the depends on the size of grater you use. Yeah, exactly. So we'll just get this up. Okay. And, and why are we doing this? Why is this important? So if you don't do this and you fry it, it's going to break up in the pan. Okay. Yeah. So you have to oh, try yeah, and get Oh yeah, that's what happens even when you're making potato parties. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll try and get as oh, much look at that. liquid as we can out. You ever thought, right? Yeah. And you can use a normal kitchen napkin if you don't have this as well. Uh, oh well, please make sure it's clean. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. <laughs> then we'll put that into a bowl. Okay. Then we're going so to we're gonna throw this away. Yeah, we don't need that anymore. So Imagine what this could do to your meal. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just allowing my imagination to run wild here. Yeah, it's fine. I'm not gonna drink it anyway, so it's a potato juice. <laughs> okay. No. So now we're going to add in our seasoning. So just add salt. Can add whatever seasoning you like. Can you use sweet potatoes as yeah. well? Yeah, you can. Because mm. I imagine making this for my daughter Elsie. I think mm. really like. Yeah, it. and they even cook faster. Mm. Yeah. Oh yeah, because they're sweet potatoes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So that's black pepper going in and yes. seasoning. So this is like a chili and garlic mix. Okay. And then some Cameroon pepper for a bit of heat. Mm. I see no seasoning in here. Um, more like seasoning cubes. Yeah, like seasoning cubes. Yeah, I don't really cook with seasoning oh, cubes. Yes. Yeah. Chefs don't cook with seasoning <laughs> cubes. So then we'll add in some beaten eggs. Okay. So this would bind everything up together. I see that's not much eggs you have in there. It's quite little. Um, it would bind it pretty well, okay. really. Yeah. And then a bit of flour. Not so much. And then to just spice it up a bit, we're going to add in our grated sausages. Oh. Yeah. And you could use corned beef or bray? Corned beef, yeah, yeah, sure. You can use that as well. Or minced meat. Is minced meat too much? Mm, yeah, that might take a bit It'll longer, longer to, to cook. cook. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So we'll just mix that in. Okay. Um, do we start heating up our pan? Yeah, we do. Okay. So we're making use of this pan, yeah? Yes. Okay, I'm just gonna move this And here. then we're going to add a bit of oil. All right. Yeah. And the pan shouldn't be hot. Oh, it shouldn't. So yeah. can I add the vegetable? No, you can add the oil now, because okay. the pan is not hot at all. OK, so I'm just going to take this off. Uh, please, is this all right? Yeah. Okay. So you just take the pan and yeah, so the, the oil, oil around. I'm just going to like yeah. make sure it goes round. Yeah as much as possible. If you're just joining us people, this morning with me is Chef Sally and we are making potato pancakes and sunny side up eggs. Uh, yeah. I really don't know why Mary is mimicking me this morning. <laughs> so once that, it doesn't have to get hot. Okay. So we're just going to, can take a measuring spoon or a normal spoon, okay. just scoop a bit so that everything can be even. Then we put it into the pan. You know, one would think because you know, because of the because of the chunkiness mm. of the potatoes, you'd rather deep fry than just 
Well, you fry. can deep fry it if you want to, but this would evenly cook it. Cook it uh, yeah, okay. it's going to get cooked. Okay. And then you need four minutes on both sides. Wow, four minutes. Yeah, just four minutes. So you give this four minutes oh. and then flip it around another four minutes and it's done. All right. Great yeah. stuff happening here on the show. So something drew me to the kitchen this morning. And yes, uh, this is your mate, just in case you don't know, <laughs> and that is Chef Sally. And Chef Sally is making breakfast. And it yeah. smells absolutely fantastic. I Thank thought it was you. Akara initially. Right? Because of because of how it looks, right? Yeah. Yeah, and then the I don't know, you must have put something in it that makes it smell Akara-ish. Mm, not really. No, I guess because like it's fried. Like okay, it's yeah. fried. Yeah, it's fried. So okay. yes. People, if you do not know what we are making this morning, we are making potato pancakes and sunny side of eggs. Yeah. Yes, people. Yeah. And uh, let's go through the ingredients. It's on your screen right there for Chef Sally. Let's run through it quickly. Yeah. And um, so yeah, we have the potatoes, mm -hmm. onions, egg, flour, um, our seasoning. So oil, salt, black pepper, Cameroon pepper. Um, yeah, I think and sausages. Okay. Yeah, so those are, those are the key ingredients. Okay, so let's remind, just in case, just for the benefit of those who just joined us. Yeah. Let's tell them what we did with our potatoes. Yeah. And how we arrived at this. So we grated our potatoes yeah. and some onions. Okay. Then put it through a cheesecloth or a napkin, a clean one, mm. and then squeeze out all the liquid. Mm. Then take it back into the bowl. And you add your, all your ingredients, so your spices, flour, your egg, and your sausages that mm. have been grated as well. Yeah. yeah. Then just get a frying pan, just a little oil. We're not deep frying, just shallow frying. Okay. And then put that in. Mm. And, and just it. in case you're wondering what it looks like before, this is what it looks like when you grate and add all of the ingredients in it. Yeah. And that is what it looks like after, after yeah. you put it in the pan. And it just takes four minutes on each mm. side to cook. So a total of eight to 10 minutes. Yeah. So you have to be very, very meticulous when yeah. doing this because you have to make sure that your potatoes are well cooked. You yeah. don't want to be, you know, using or you're eating. Yeah, <laughs> eating raw potatoes. Raw potatoes. Yeah. Okay, so I guess we just have to move this to this burner yeah. and then get to our sunny side up because a lot yeah. of people actually have challenges with making sunny side up, especially because no one wants to be eating raw eggs. Yeah, but it's not that bad, really. Mm. And if you really pair it with this, because this now is going to be a bit dry, yeah. so you need something soft, runny, something runny, yes, yeah. to complement it. Okay. So we're just putting a little bit of oil. Okay. Just a little. And then the trick is you break your egg yeah. into a bowl. You're the first chef I'm seeing breaking. Make, who's making some sunny side up eggs and then you, first of all you break in the bowl usually they break it straight into the yes. pan but the thing is some eggs you get them and once you break it the yolk oh yeah it spreads. Yeah, yeah, it spreads yeah so it's better yeah. to do this first and also to make sure your egg is good okay let's see how let's see this trick yeah so you just pour it gently at the middle ah, and, and it comes out it. really nice yeah just don't shake it, just leave it and it's a cook. I'm one of those people who always add seasonings to No, it. we would add, yeah. so we're going to add some salt and black pepper. Oh, okay. So just wait for it to um, cook a little, cook a little. Mm -hmm. then we'll add our spices on top. Okay. So. It's coming out really nice. Yeah. Coming out very, very, very nice. Okay. But our potatoes are not ready yet, right? Um, they are actually. I'll just leave the pan to do the remaining of the cooking. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, and it's the holidays. Kids are definitely going to love this. They're yeah. definitely going to love this. I mean, you could actually also use sweet potatoes, you know, to come up with this recipe. Yeah. yeah. And you were saying you would like to add milk. Yes, I would like to add milk. Yeah. You know, to give it a little bit of spunk. Yes, and creaminess. And creaminess, yes. Because yeah. you're talking about how dry it looks when you're done frying it, especially yeah. if you're not deep frying it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, I think a little bit of milk, or a lot of milk, because I love milk. <laughs> Yeah. Would, you know, okay. So what so, are you adding? What's that you put? So this is um, a chili and garlic, garlic mix. Garlic mix, okay. Yeah. And that's just it. Oh, okay. You just leave it to cook. Well, the, okay. the, the, the funny thing, you can leave it to cook longer okay. until the yolk is really hard. hard. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I do. I make sure that it, yolk is hard. <laughs> I make sure. And if I'm not patient, <laughs> I flip it to the other side. <laughs> I toss it to the other side and I'm yeah. like, oh yeah, good to go. Whether we like it or not, this is my sunny side up. <laughs> so 
So that's just sitting in a nutshell. Okay, I really have to be patient when working with sunny side of the air. Yeah, like, you have to be. Patient. Yeah, if not, you have to start doing it over again. Over again. Yes. Yeah. Uh, great stuff happening here on the show, people. If you're just joining us with me, is Chef Sally. Yes, and this morning she's making potato pancakes with sunny side of eggs. And of course, we're also having um, a side dish salad. Let's talk yeah. about the salad because this really looks good. Yeah, so it's just um, lettuce, mm -hmm. so um, not lettuce, spinach. So the normal green spinach we're used to, and then there's the purple spinach as well. Okay. And some cherry tomatoes. If you don't want to use cherry tomatoes, you can actually use strawberries. Oh, okay. They really go well with spinach. So we're not adding any cream or anything else um, The only thing I've done is to add oil, salt, black pepper, um, then a bit of lemon juice and orange juice oh, to yeah. give it sweetness. Let's talk about lemons. I yeah. see what you did with the lemons while the potatoes were frying. Why yeah. was that? So I just drizzled some lemons just to bring out the flavor a bit. Okay. That's just it's just for more flavor. But it's more flavor. Yeah. And well, it's not compulsory. <laughs> no, it's not. So we don't go and squeeze a whole lemon in it. No. <laughs> no please it's don't. not compulsory, people. If you like. If you don't, I mean, yeah. it's, it's really not composed. But really, basically, the role of lemon to any meal that you're cooking, basically, is just to activate the flavors of what you make cooking. That's yeah. it. All right, I saw the side up is almost ready. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> this yolk is not runny, so yes, this works for me. Because <laughs> it's not runny. Well, it's good when you break into it. Uh, that part I do not like. <laughs> <laughs> but you should definitely give give this a try. If you don't like it, you can scrap it. But just give okay. it a try. Yeah. yeah. So yes, we are yeah, walking into the it. weekend. It's almost the weekend actually. Yeah. yeah. So this is one breakfast recipe that I think you watching at home should definitely try this weekend. Or yeah, this weekend. Yeah. For the kids. Yeah. Or for the family. You know, not every time bread and egg. <laughs> Or yam and egg, or thin and egg sometimes. <laughs> Let's, you know, work some magic. Yeah. I mean, if Irish potatoes are too expensive, because they can be pretty pricey. Mm, yeah. You could try sweet potatoes, because they're very affordable. On your screen right there are the ingredients, people. So I hope you go grab a pen and a piece of paper and scribble down those ingredients. And um, yeah, it's a very, very easy recipe. Very easy to make, very simple, not hard and Different, you know, right? Yeah. Okay. Different. That's just so it. what? What next? What's next? Because the sunny side up is ready. Yeah. So that's just it, and yeah. we'll just leave this to just okay, cook, to cook a, a little bit. more. So yeah. Make sure all of that, you know, goes in. So it really doesn't matter if it's brown or you like if it gets really like more like yeah it doesn't matter just make sure it doesn't get black black because that's burnt oh, okay yes <laughs> yeah that's burnt okay so we'll just leave this and do you want the outside layer to be crispy as well mm. you see a bit more depth oh yeah okay so. so if you're watching right now you're wondering what those those things are in those is that grated sausage yes yeah, grated sausages so everything here is grated the onions grated the yeah. sausages the potatoes and, um, and like you said, you can also grate it to be a bit finer if you yeah, don't want to like, like it like this. Mm. Yeah. I think I would like it smaller. Yeah. So I think I'll just use the, the smaller Smallest. part of yeah, the yeah, grater. Like Where is this? it? Oh, yeah. I'd, I'd rather use this part of the grater. Yeah. Yeah, because like this, it's come out like Akara or or Jojo. <laughs> you know I, mean? I love food. No problem. <laughs> I love food. Yeah. Yes, people. Uh, Amazing stuff happening here on the show, and Chef Sally is working her magic as usual. I can't wait to have a taste of that later on. Welcome to nice. the kitchen. Hey, you are. Slammy. Welcome. Something Thank looks you. good. Yes. Mm. All right. So, this so is where it's happening yeah, right this is where it happens. Oh, actually. Wow. Yeah. And um, <laughs> we have a slamming breakfast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is Chef Sally. Okay, Chef Sally. Uh, yeah, this morning she's made potato pancakes with sunny side ups and some um, salad to go along. Yeah. Yeah. So um, while she's having a taste, please, Sally. Over to you. Tell us how you mm. put this together. So basically, the main ingredients: um, your potatoes, sausages, eggs, spices, and flour. Please have a taste. Yeah, yeah. Where do I start from? Anyway. Yeah, anyway. So you can start like from the, food, uh, from you can start from the potato. Uh, finish up. Yeah, finish up. All right, take a big thank uh, you to our okay. friends at Homely and you for the kitchen accessories. Yes, yes, indeed. And a big shout out to everyone who's been on the show today. We appreciate you. Yeah, thanks, Lamy, for joining us. Yes, sir. And Chef Sally, well done. Sally, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
You like okay. it? Love it? Mm. I can finish all that. Yeah, it's yeah, all it's yours. yours. It's That's all yours. Your Thank you. <laughs> nice one. All right, the show is not over. We're heading over to the garden. Uh, where, you know, a performance, you, you were with yes. them earlier on. VOS Band mm. and Pastor Ben. Yes, indeed. Take See you away. tomorrow, everybody. Bye. Bye. <laughs>